Another big weekend of college football is less than 24 hours away. Good Friday evening, everyone. There are just two weeks of regular season play left for both Michigan Tech and Northern Michigan. Although the Huskies and Wildcats have opposite records, they both have something to play for tomorrow afternoon. There is only one matchup between two top 25 Division II football teams this weekend, and it's in the Copper Country. The 20th ranked Huskies will battle the 22nd ranked Ashland Eagles tomorrow at 1 p.m. Both teams are fighting for what could be just one playoff spot. The game could determine which team makes the postseason and which team watches the postseason from home. It's a fun game to play because you know the stakes are so high. Uh, you know, both teams have aspirations to, you know, to keep playing. You know, beyond the regular season, both know that if they lose this football game, that you know those aspirations are done. So that increases it, but it's still going to come down to the team that plays better football. I'd say it's basically a playoff game. Um, winner of this game's, you know, putting themselves in a lot better position to make playoffs. So I, basically, it's a winner go home situation. Last week we came into the game saying that it was playoffs already, so we've been have a mindset on that uh, so far, and uh, you know, really do or die really this week. While the Huskies are at home, NMU is on the road, facing number four Ferris State. NMU can help out Michigan Tech if they were to take down Ferris State. The Wildcats will try and slow down Bulldogs quarterback Jason Vanderland, who put up 499 yards of offense last week against Lake Erie. He's operating at, at, at a success rate that's off the charts. So uh, he's up for the Harlan Hill, which is the Division II version of the Heisman Trophy, and he's, he's a special football player. Other offense, you know, it's formed around him. I mean, he's a well-deserved player, you know, for all of his accolades and stuff. So a big deal with our defense is to contain him and stuff. So if we can do that, I think we can come out with a victory. Kickoff from Big Rapids is set for noon.